All right, sneak peek number two or three or four today. 1985 Jeep CJ7. Original motor. And um, in pretty decent shape. Got a little bit of an oil leak going on right now, so I got to deal with that. Does not have the hard top, but it has a soft top. As you can see, it needs to be clean. It's over here in our shop. Has a little, um, uh, you know, keep your junk thing. It's an automatic, but you can see it there. Seats are in good condition. Okay. Um, I've got a cover for it. I guess whoever buys it can can uh, get the cover and I bought these things right here you know the pad to put on the bars and I haven't put those on and then I got these things right here little brush guards you know that go down there but uh I don't have a whole lot of room in here so I'm just kind of trying to do a little bit of a walk around uh but it's a it's a pretty pretty jeep nice nice tires nice rims i don't have the one for the back i was gonna get it but just you know you know how it is good looking uh what are those 33s i think and it's got the soft doors definitely needs to be clean it's just been sitting in here front grill there let me close her up you can see the motor this thing closed up so you can see it it's not perfect i'm not gonna say it's perfect by any means you know it's a antique but it really needs to be cleaned right now back up so you can see it but it's a good representation of a uh an 85 it's got some kind of leak in it. I got to figure that out. Just came in here the other day. I had the worst luck. I bought two Jeeps and both of them had, had uh, crazy leaks. So I'm going a different direction. So I'm getting rid of the Jeeps. So this is Jeep number one. The black CJ without um, a hard top. Just has a soft top. Jeep number two i got the trickle charger on here trickle charging the battery let me get that out of the way see if i can close it this one uh same thing had a leak that got started on it and i have just been too busy working get this stuff out of the way sorry uh to deal with it but here's your motor And let's close her up. I'm just going to sit this right here for right now. A little dirty, but this is a pretty, pretty, pretty Jeep. Started leaking oil, so I put it on the, the uh, little sliders there over in the shop. And what's up on top is just a one of those, um, it doesn't even go with this, it just got put up there. Uh, insulated blanket things. We'll see if I can, I'm in between a work trailer and a tractor. See if I can get, okay. This is a 1985 as well. It's This one uh, has been repainted. Looks like they did a pretty good job on it. I think these maybe are 31s. I'm not really sure. They're not quite as new as the other one, the black one. But this one has a hard top and, you know, hard doors and everything. So you can see it. Good seats. Good quality. And this one has a soft top as well. And a hard top. I think the soft top is back there. Yeah.
it's practically brand new. So, and it already has the roll bar pad on it. Let's see if I can back up so you can see it. it does have a spare. I will probably, this one, I'll probably sell it. Once I get it fixed, I'll probably sell this one for probably 10000 somewhere around that range. I'd be willing to entertain some offers. But it's, it's pretty nice. Hard top, soft top. Got the little Nerf bars. As you can see, this is that insulated blanket that I used to do. I had that on my, some of my plant stuff that I do. <clears throat> but this is uh this one's a little cleaner than the other one automatic as well a little bit nicer seats but same issue got got an oil leak that I need to mess with but you know these things are so old and from 1985 how old is that I don't know that's old <clears throat> hard doors as I said uh, hard top and soft top Let's see if I can get a good view again I just got them kind of stuffed in here so, all right, two Jeeps. I'll say what, uh, probably I got to get them fixed. I'll do 10,000 on the white one and probably eight on the black one. Somewhere around that range. Might be willing to trade for an RZR or a, a nice, whatever that new Can-Am is. And I'll throw in a little money if you want two Jeeps. If you want one, we can talk. I'll consider offers. I'm always up for negotiating. All right, there you go.